Phillips, Wikipedia article audio. Koning Kleeke Philips NV is a Dutch technology company headquartered in Amsterdam currently focused in the area of healthcare. It was founded in Eindhoven in 1891, by Gerard Philips and his father Frederick. It was once one of the largest electronic conglomerates in the world and currently employs around 105,000 people across more than 60 countries. History Philips is organized into three main divisions, Philips Consumer Lifestyle, Philips Healthcare, and Philips Lighting. As of 2012, Philips was the largest manufacturer of lighting in the world measured by applicable revenues. In 2013, the company announced the sale of the bulk of its remaining consumer electronics to Japan's Fune Electric CO, but in October 2013, the deal to Fune Electric CO was broken off and the consumer electronics operations remain under Philips. Philips said it would seek damages for breach of contract in the US$200 million sale. In April 2016, the International Court of Arbitration ruled in favor of Philips, awarding compensation of €135 million Euros in the process. Philips has a primary listing on the Euronext Amsterdam Stock Exchange and is a component of the Eurostoss 50 Stock Market Index. It has a secondary listing on the New York Stock Exchange. Philips Radio The Philips Company was founded in 1891, by Gerard Philips and his father Frederick. Frederick a Jewish banker based in Zaltbommel, financed the purchase and setup of an empty factory building in Eindhoven, where the company started the production of carbon filament lamps and other electrotechnical products in 1892. This first factory has been adapted and is used as a museum. Sterling Engine In 1895, after a difficult first few years and near bankruptcy, the Phillipses brought in Anton, Gerard's younger brother by 16 years. Though he had earned a degree in engineering, Anton started work as a sales representative. Soon, however, he began to contribute many important business ideas. With Anton's arrival, the family business began to expand rapidly resulting in the founding of Philips Metal Glowalamp Fabrik NV in Eindhoven in 1908, followed in 1912, by the foundation of Philips Glowalamp and Fabrik and NV. After Gerard and Anton Philips changed their family business by founding the Philips Corporation, they laid the foundations for the later electronics multinational. Shavers in the 1920s, the company started to manufacture other products, such as vacuum tubes. In 1939, they introduced their electric razor, the Feely Shave. The chapel is a radio with built-in loudspeaker, which was designed during the early 1930s. World War II On March 11, 1927, Philips went on the air with shortwave radio station PCJJ which was joined in 1929 by sister station Fohi. Fohi broadcast in Dutch to the Dutch East Indies while PCJJ broadcast in English, Spanish and German to the rest of the world. 1945-2001 The international program on Sundays commenced in 1928 with host Eddie Starts hosting the Happy Station show, which became the world's longest-running shortwave program. Broadcasts from the Netherlands were interrupted by the German invasion in May 1940. The Germans commandeered the transmitters in Huizen to use for pro-Nazi broadcasts, some originating from Germany, 
others concerts from Dutch broadcasters under German control. Philips Radio was absorbed shortly after liberation when its two shortwave stations were nationalized in 1947 and renamed Radio Netherlands Worldwide, the Dutch International Service. Some PCJ programs, such as Happy Station, continued on the new station. 2001 to 2011 2011 to present Corporate Affairs CEOs Philips was instrumental in the revival of the Stirling engine when, in the early 1930s, the management decided that offering a low-power portable generator would assist in expanding sales of its radios into parts of the world where mains electricity was unavailable and the supply of batteries uncertain. Engineers at the company's research lab carried out a systematic comparison of various power sources and determined that the almost forgotten Stirling engine would be most suitable citing its quiet operation and ability to run on a variety of heat sources. They were also aware that, unlike steam and internal combustion engines, virtually no serious development work had been carried out on the Stirling engine for many years and asserted that modern materials and know-how should enable great improvements. Encouraged by their first experimental engine, which produced 16 W of shaft power from a bore and stroke of 30 mm x 25 mm, various development models were produced in a program which continued throughout World War II. By the late 1940s, the Type 10 was ready to be handed over to Philips subsidiary Johann de Witt in Dordrecht to be produced and incorporated into a generator set as originally planned. The result, rated at 180-200W electrical output from a bore and stroke of 55 mm x 27 mm, was designated MP1002CA. Production of an initial batch of 250 began in 1951, but it became clear that they could not be made at a competitive price, besides with the advent of transistor radios with their much lower power requirements meant that the original rationale for the set was disappearing. Approximately 150 of these sets were eventually produced. In parallel with the generator set Philips developed experimental Stirling engines for a wide variety of applications and continued to work in the field until the late 1970s though the only commercial success was the reversed Stirling engine cryo-cooler. However, they filed a large number of patents and amassed a wealth of information, which they later licensed to other companies. The first Philips shaver was introduced in the 1930s, and was simply called the Feely Shave. In the USA, it was called the Norelco which remains a part of their product line today. On May 9, 1940, the Philips directors learned that the German invasion of the Netherlands was to take place the following day. Having prepared for this, Anton Philips and his son-in-law Franz Auden, as well as other Philips family members, fled to the United States, taking a large amount of the company capital with them. Operating from the U.S. as the North American Philips Company, they managed to run the company throughout the war. At the same time, the company was moved to the Netherlands Antilles to keep it out of American hands. On December 6, 1942, the British No. 2 Group RAF led an air raid which heavily damaged the Philips radio factory in Eindhoven with few casualties among the Dutch workers and civilians. The Philips works in Eindhoven was bombed again by the RAF on March 30, 1943. Fritz Philips, the son of Anton, was the only Philips family member to stay in the Netherlands. He saved the lives of 382 Jews by convincing the Nazis that they were indispensable for the production process at Philips. 
In 1943 he was held at the internment camp for political prisoners at Voot for several months because a strike at his factory reduced production. For his actions in saving the hundreds of Jews, he was recognized by Yad Vashem in 1995 as a righteous among the nations. After the war the company was moved back to the Netherlands, with their headquarters in Eindhoven. In 1949, the company began selling television sets. In 1950, it formed Philips Records, which eventually formed part of Polygram. 1891-1922, Gerard Phillips, 1922-1939, Anton Phillips, 1939-1961, Franz Auden, 1961-1971, Fritz Phillips, 1971-1977, Hank Van Riemsdijk, 1977-1981, Nico Rodenberg, 1981-1982, C.O.R. Dillon, 1982-1986, Wiss Decker, 1986-1990, C.O.R. Van der Klut, 1990-1996, Jan Timmer, 1996-2001, C.O.R. Boonstra, 2001-2011, Gerard Kleisterly, 2011 present, Franz Van Houten. Phillips introduced the audio compact audio cassette tape in 1963, and it was wildly successful. Compact cassettes were initially used for dictation machines for office typing stenographers and professional journalists. As their sound quality improved, Cassettes would also be used to record sound and became the second mass media alongside vinyl records used to sell recorded music. Philips introduced the first combination portable radio and cassette recorder, which was marketed as the radio recorder, and is now better known as the boombox. Later, the cassette was used in telephone answering machines including a special form of cassette where the tape was wound on an endless loop. The C cassette was used as the first mass storage device for early personal computers in the 1970s and 1980s. Philips reduced the cassette size for the professional needs with the mini cassette, although it would not be as successful as the Olympus microcassette. This became the predominant dictation medium up to the advent of fully digital dictation machines. Philips continued with computers through the early 1990s. In 1972, Philips launched the world's first home video cassette recorder, in the UK, the N1500. Its relatively bulky video cassettes could record 30 minutes or 45 minutes. Later one-hour tapes were also offered. As competition came from Sony S Betamax and the VHS group of manufacturers, Philips introduced the N1700 system which allowed double-length recording. For the first time, a two-hour movie could fit onto one video cassette. In 1977, the company unveiled a special promotional film for this system in the UK, featuring comedian Dennis Norton. The concept was quickly copied by the Japanese makers, whose tapes were significantly cheaper. Philips made one last attempt at a new standard for video recorders with the Video 2000 system, with tapes that could be used on both sides and had eight hours of total recording time. As Philips only sold its systems on the PAL standard and in Europe, and the Japanese makers sold globally, the scale advantages of the Japanese proved insurmountable and Philips withdrew the V2000 system and joined the VHS coalition. Philips had developed a laser disc early on for selling movies, but delayed its commercial launch for fear of cannibalizing its video recorder sales. 
Later Philips joined with MCA to launch the first commercial Laserdisc standard and players. In 1982, Philips teamed with Sony to launch the compact disc, this format evolved into the CDR, CDRW, DVD, and later Blu-ray, which Philips launched with Sony in 1997 and 2006 respectively. In 1984, the Dutch Philips Group bought out nearly a one-third share and took over the management of German company Grundig. In 1984, Philips split off its activities on the field of photolithographic integrated circuit production equipment, the so-called wafer steppers, into a joint venture with ASM International, located in Feldhoven under the name ASML. Over the years, this new company has evolved into the world's leading manufacturer of chip production machines at the expense of competitors like Nikon and Canon. In 1991, the company's name was changed from NV. Philips Glowalam Penfabrik into Philips Electronics NV. At the same time, North American Philips was formally dissolved and a new corporate division was formed in the U.S. with the name Philips Electronics North America Corp. In 1991-1992, Philips along with their subsidiary Magnavox, released the Philips CDI, a combined CD player and home video game console. It sold 1 million units and was discontinued in 1998 after being heavily criticized amongst the gaming community. In 1997, the company officers decided to move the headquarters from Eindhoven to Amsterdam along with the corporate name change to Conning Cliquey Philips Electronics NV. The move was completed in 2001. Initially, the company was housed in the Rembrandt Tower, but in 2002 they moved again, this time to the Breitnetter Tower. Philips Lighting, Philips Research, Philips Semiconductors, and Philips Design, are still based in Eindhoven. Philips Healthcare is headquartered in both Best, Netherlands and Andover, Massachusetts, United States. In 2000, Philips bought Optiva Corporation, the maker of Sonicare electric toothbrushes. The company was renamed Philips Oral Healthcare and made a subsidiary of Philips DAP. In 2001, Philips acquired Agilent Technologies Healthcare Solutions Group for €2 billion. Euros. In 2004, Philips abandoned the slogan Let's Make Things Better in favor of a new one, Sense and Simplicity. In December 2005 Philips announced its intention to sell or demerge its semiconductor division. On September 1, 2006, it was announced in Berlin that the name of the new company formed by the division would be NXP Semiconductors. On August 2, 2006, Philips completed an agreement to sell a controlling 80.1% stake in NXP Semiconductors to a consortium of private equity investors consisting of Kohlberg Kravis Roberts & Co., Silver Lake Partners and Alp Invest Partners. On August 21, 2006, Bain Capital and Apex Partners announced that they had signed definitive commitments to join the acquiring consortium, a process which was completed on October 1, 2006. In 2006 Philips bought out the company Lifeline Systems headquartered in Framingham, Massachusetts in a deal valued at $750 million its biggest move yet to expand its consumer health business. CFOs In August 2007, Philips acquired the company Zimmies, Inc. headquartered in El Paso, Texas for their medical informatics division. In October 2007, it purchased a more microprocessor patent portfolio license from the TPL Group. 
On December 21, 2007, Philips and Resoronics, Inc. announced a definitive agreement pursuant to which Philips acquired all of the outstanding shares of Resoronics for $66 US per share, or a total purchase price of approximately €3.6 billion Euros in cash. On February 21, 2008, Philips completed the acquisition of Visico Baltimore, Maryland through the merger of its indirect wholly owned subsidiary into Visico. As a result of that merger, Visico has become an indirect wholly owned subsidiary of Philips. Visico was the creator of the EICU concept of the use of telemedicine from a centralized facility to monitor and care for ICU patients. The Philips Physics Laboratory was scaled down in the early 21st century, as the company ceased trying to be innovative in consumer electronics through fundamental research. In January 2011, Philips agreed to acquire the assets of Preethi, a leading India-based kitchen appliances company. On June 27, 2011, Philips acquired Sectra Mamiaib, the mammography division of Sectra Ib, together with the Microdose brand. Because net profit slumped 85% in Q3 2011, Philips announced a cut of 4,500 jobs to match part of an €800 million Euros cost cutting scheme to boost profits and meet its financial target. Acquisitions in March 2012, Philips announced its intention to sell, or demerge its television manufacturing operations to TPV Technology. Operations Asia 2003-2008, Theo Van Dersen, 2012-present, Eric Rondolate 1960-1968 C.O.R. Dillon, 2015-present, Abhijit Bhattacharya Thailand Hamburg, Distribution Center of the Division's Healthcare, Consumer Lifestyle and Lighting, Philips Medical Systems DMC, Philips Innovative Technologies, Research Laboratories Hong Kong Mainland China Philips Healthcare Informatics, Belfast develops healthcare software products, Philips Consumer Products, Guilford provides sales and marketing for televisions, including high-definition televisions, DVD recorders, hi-fi and portable audio, CD recorders, PC peripherals, cordless telephones, home and kitchen appliances, personal care. Philips Dictation Systems, Colchester, Philips Lighting, Sales from Guilford and Manufacture in Hamilton, Philips Healthcare, Rygate. Sales and technical support for X-ray, ultrasound, nuclear medicine, patient monitoring, magnetic resonance, computed tomography and resuscitation products, Philips Research Laboratories, Cambridge. Consumer Product Manufacturing in Croydon, Television Tube Manufacturing Mullard Simonstone, Philips Business Communications, Cambridge, offered voice and data communications products, specializing in customer relationship management applications, IP telephony, data networking, voice processing, command and control systems and cordless and mobile telephony. In 2006 the business was placed into a 60-40th joint venture with NEC. NEC later acquired 100% ownership and the business was renamed NEC Unified Solutions, Philips Electronics Blackburn, Vacuum Tubes, Capacitors, Delay Lines, Laser Discs, CDs, Philips Domestic Appliances Hastings, Design and Production of Electric Kettles, 
fan heaters plus former Echo brand thermotube tubular heaters and Hostess domestic food warming trolleys, Philips Semiconductors, Hazel Grove, Stockport and Southampton, both also earlier part of Mullard. These became part of NXP, London Carriers, Logistics and Transport Division, Mullard Equipment Limited which produced products for the military. Pi Telecommunications Ltd of Cambridge, TMC Limited of Malmesbury, Pi TVT Ltd of Cambridge. CT Scan In 2011, the company posted a loss of 1.3 billion euros, but earned a net profit in Q1 and Q2 2012. However the management wanted 1.1 billion euros cost cutting which was an increase from 800 million euros and may cut another 2,200 jobs until end of 2014. India On December 5, 2012, the antitrust regulators of the European Union fined Philips and several other major companies for fixing prices of TV cathode ray tubes in two cartels lasting nearly a decade. On January 29, 2013, it was announced that Philips had agreed to sell its audio and video operations to the Japan-based Fune Electric for €150 million. Euros with the audio business planned to transfer to Fune in the latter half of 2013, and the video business in 2017. As part of the transaction, Fune was to pay a regular licensing fee to Philips for the use of the Philips brand. The purchase agreement was terminated by Philips in October because of breach of contract. Israel in April 2013, Philips announced a collaboration with Paradox Engineering for the realization and implementation of a pilot project on network-connected street lighting management solutions. This project was endorsed by the San Francisco Public Utilities Commission. In 2013, Philips omitted the word electronics from its name which is now Royal Philips NV. Pakistan On November 13, 2013, Philips unveiled its new brand line Innovation and U and a new design of its shield mark. The new brand positioning is cited by Philips to signify company's evolution and emphasize that innovation is only meaningful if it is based on an understanding of people's needs and desires. On April 28, 2014, Philips agreed to sell their Wux Innovations subsidiary to Gibson Brands for US$135 million. Europe On September 23, 2014, Philips announced a plan to split the company into two, separating the lighting business from the healthcare and consumer lifestyle divisions. It moved to complete this in March 2015 to an investment group for $3.3 billion. On February 2015, Philips acquired Volcano Corporation to strengthen its position in non-invasive surgery and imaging. France In June 2016, Philips spun off its lighting division to focus on the healthcare division. In June 2017, Philips announced it would acquire US-based Spectranetics Corp., a manufacturer of devices to treat heart disease, for €1.9 billion Euros expanding its current image-guided therapy business. Germany Past and Present CEOs CEOs Lighting Past and Present CFOs Greece. Companies acquired by Philips through the years include ADAC Laboratories, Agilent Healthcare Solutions Group, Amperex, ATL Ultrasound, Echo, Lifeline Systems, Magnavox, Marconi Medical Systems, Mullard, 
Optiva, Prithia, Pi, Resaronix, Inc., Sectramamiab, Cynetics, Visicu, Volcano, VLSI, Zimis, portions of Westinghouse and the consumer electronics operations of Philco and Sylvania. Philips abandoned the Sylvania trademark which is now owned by Havel Sylvania except in Australia, Canada, Mexico, New Zealand, Puerto Rico, and the USA where it is owned by Osram. Formed in November 1999 as an equal joint venture between Philips and Agilent Technologies, the light-emitting diode manufacturer Lumi LEDs became a subsidiary of Philips Lighting in August 2005 and a fully-owned subsidiary in December 2006. An 80.1% stake in Lumi LEDs was sold to GoScale in early 2015. Italy Philips is registered in the Netherlands as a Namlo's venue chap and has its global headquarters in Amsterdam. At the end of 2013 Philips had 111 manufacturing facilities, 59 R&D facilities across 26 countries and sales and service operations in around 100 countries. Philips is organized into three main divisions. Philips Consumer Lifestyle, Philips Healthcare, and Philips Lighting. Philips achieved total revenues of €22.579 billion Euros in 2011, of which €8.852 billion Euros were generated by Philips Healthcare, €7.638 billion Euros by Philips Lighting, €5.823 billion Euros by Philips Consumer Lifestyle and €266 million Euros from group activities. At the end of 2011 Philips had a total of 121,888 employees, of whom around 44% were employed in Philips Lighting, 31% in Philips Healthcare and 15% in Philips Consumer Lifestyle. Poland. Philips invested a total of 1.61 billion euros in research and development in 2011, equivalent to 7.1% of sales. Philips Intellectual Property and Standards is the group wide division responsible for licensing, trademark protection, and patenting. Philips currently holds around 54,000 patent rights. 39,000 trademarks, 70,000 design rights and 4,400 domain name registrations. Philips Thailand was established in 1952. It is a subsidiary which produces healthcare, lifestyle, and lighting products. Philips started manufacturing in Thailand in 1960 with an incandescent lamp factory. Philips has diversified its production facilities to include a fluorescent lamp factory and a luminaries factory, serving Thai and worldwide markets. Philips Hong Kong began operation in 1948. Philips Hong Kong houses the global headquarters of Philips Audio Business Unit. It also has Philips Asia Pacific Regional Office and headquarters for its design division domestic appliances and personal care products division, lighting products division and medical system products division. In 1974, Philips opened a lamp factory in Hong Kong. This has a capacity of 200 million pieces a year and is certified with ISO 9001 2000 and ISO 14001. Its product portfolio includes Prefocus, Lensend, and E10 miniature light bulbs. Philips established in Zhuhai, Guangdong in 1990. The site mainly manufactures Feely shaves and healthcare products. In early 2008, Philips Lighting, a division of Royal Philips Electronics, opened a small engineering center in Shanghai to adapt the company's products to vehicles in Asia. 
Philips began operations in India in 1930, with the establishment of Philips Electrical Co. PVT Ltd in Kolkata as a sales outlet for imported Philips lamps. In 1938, Philips established its first Indian lamp manufacturing factory in Kolkata. In 1948, Philips started manufacturing radios in Kolkata. In 1959, a second radio factory was established near Pun. This was closed and sold around 2006. In 1957, the company converted into a public limited company, renamed Philips India Ltd. In 1970 a new consumer electronics factory began operations in Pimpri near Pun. This is now called the Philips Healthcare Innovation Center. Also, a manufacturing facility Philips Center for Manufacturing Excellence was set up in Chakan, Pun in 2012. In 1996, the Philips Software Center was established in Bangalore, later renamed the Philips Innovation Campus. In 2008, Philips India entered the water purifier market. In 2014, Philips was ranked 12th among India's most trusted brands according to the Brand Trust Report, a study conducted by Trust Research Advisory. Philips has been active in Israel since 1948 and in 1998, set up a wholly owned subsidiary, Philips Electronics Ltd. The company has over 700 employees in Israel and generated sales of over $300 million in 2007. Philips Medical Systems Technologies Limited is a developer and manufacturer of computerized tomography, diagnostic and medical imaging systems. The company was founded in 1969 as Elsint by Elrin Electronic Industries and was acquired by Marconi Medical Systems in 1998, which was itself acquired by Philips in 2001. Philips Semiconductors formerly had major operations in Israel, these now form part of NXP Semiconductors. Philips has been active in Pakistan since 1948 and has a wholly owned subsidiary, Philips Pakistan Limited. The head office is in Karachi with regional sales offices in Lahore and Rawalpindi. Portugal Philips France has its headquarters in Schuersens. The company employs over 3,600 people nationwide. Sweden. Philips Lighting has manufacturing facilities in Chalon sur Saone, Chartres, Lamotte Bouvron, Longvic, Miribel, Nevers. United Kingdom. Philips Germany was founded in 1926 in Berlin. Now its headquarters is located in Hamburg. Over 4,900 people are employed in Germany. North America Philips Greece is headquartered in Halandry, Attica. As of 2012 Philips has no manufacturing plants in Greece, although there have been in the past. Canada Mexico United States Oceania Australia and New Zealand South America Brazil Philips founded its Italian headquarter in 1918, basing it in Monza where it still operates, for commercial activities only. Philips operations in Poland include, a European financial and accounting center in Lodz, Philips Lighting Facilities in Bielskobiala, Pabianica, Pila, and Ketrazin, and a Philips Domestic Appliances Facility in Biawistok. Philips started business in Portugal in 1927, as Philips Portuguesa S.A.R.L. Currently, 
Philips Portuguesa SA is headquartered in Oeiras near Lisbon. There were three Philips factories in Portugal, the Fape Lamp factory in Lisbon, the Carnaxide Magnetic Core Memory factory near Lisbon, where the Philips Service Organization was also based, and the Ovar factory in northern Portugal making camera components and remote control devices. The company still operates in Portugal with divisions for commercial lighting, medical systems, and domestic appliances. Philips Sweden has two main sites, Kista, Stockholm County, with regional sales, marketing, and a customer support organization and Solna, Stockholm County, with the main office of the mammography division. Philips UK has its headquarters in Guildford. The company employs over 2,500 people nationwide. In the past, Philips UK also included Philips Canada was founded in 1934. It is well known in medical systems for diagnosis and therapy, lighting technologies, shavers, and consumer electronics. The Canadian headquarters are located in Markham, Ontario. For several years, Philips manufactured lighting products in two Canadian factories. The London, Ontario, plant opened in 1971. It produced A19 lamps, PAR38 lamps, and T19 lamps. Philips closed the factory in May 2003. The Trois-Rivières, Quebec plant was a Westinghouse facility which Philips continued to run it after buying Westinghouse's lamp division in 1983. Philips closed this factory a few years later, in the late 1980s. Philips Mexicana S.A. to C.V. is headquartered in Mexico City. Philips Lighting has manufacturing facilities in Monterrey, Nuevo Leon, Ciudad Juarez, Chihuahua, and Tijuana, Baja California. Philips Consumer Electronics has a manufacturing facility in Ciudad Juarez, Chihuahua. Philips Domestic Appliances formerly operated a large factory in the industrial Vallejo sector of Mexico City but this was closed in 2004. Philips Electronics North American Headquarters is in Andover, Massachusetts. In early 2018, it was announced that the U.S. headquarters would move to Cambridge, Massachusetts by 2020. Philips Lighting has its corporate office in Somerset, New Jersey, with manufacturing plants in Danville, Kentucky, Dallas, Salina, Kansas, and Paris, Texas and distribution centers in Mountain Top, Pennsylvania El Paso, Texas, Ontario, California, and Memphis, Tennessee. Philips Healthcare is headquartered in Cambridge, Massachusetts. The North American Sales Organization is based in Bothell, Washington. There are also manufacturing facilities in Andover, Massachusetts, Bothell, Washington, Baltimore, Maryland, Cleveland, Ohio, Foster City, California, Gainesville, Florida, Milpitas, California, and Reedsville, Pennsylvania. Philips Healthcare also formerly had a factory in Knoxville. Tennessee. Philips Consumer Lifestyle has its corporate office in Stamford, Connecticut. Philips Lighting has a Color Kinetics office in Burlington, Massachusetts. Philips Research North American headquarters is in Cambridge, Massachusetts. In 2007, Philips entered into a definitive merger agreement with North American Luminaires company Genlight Group Inc., which provides the company with a leading position in the North American Luminaires, controls, and related products for a wide variety of applications, including solid-state lighting. The company also acquired Resaronics, 
which was a significant gain for its health care sector. On February 21, 2008 Philips completed the acquisition of Visica Baltimore, Maryland. Visica was the creator of the EICU concept of the use of telemedicine from a centralized facility to monitor and care for ICU patients. Philips Australia was founded in 1927 and is headquartered in North Ryde, New South Wales and also manages the New Zealand operation from there. The company currently employs around 800 people. Regional sales and support offices are located in Melbourne, Brisbane, Adelaide, Perth and Auckland. Current activities include, Philips Healthcare, Philips Lighting, Philips Oral Healthcare, Philips Professional Dictation Solutions, Philips Professional Display Solutions, Philips Avant Professional, Philips Consumer Lifestyle, Philips Sleep and Respiratory Care, with its ever-increasing national network of sleep easy centers, Philips Dynalite and Philips Selecan NZ. Philips do Brasil was founded in 1924 in Rio de Janeiro. In 1929, Philips started to sell radio receivers. In the 1930s, Philips was making its light bulbs and radio receivers in Brazil. From 1939 to 1945, World War II forced Brazilian branch of Philips to sell bicycles, refrigerators and insecticides. After the war, Philips had a great industrial expansion in Brazil, and was among the first groups to establish in Manaus Free Zone. In the 1970s, Philips Records was a major player in Brazil recording industry. Nowadays, Philips do Brazil is one of the largest foreign-owned companies in Brazil. Philips uses the brand Weileta for domestic appliances in Brazil. Philips subsidiary Philips Dubhar manufactured pharmaceuticals for human and veterinary use and products for crop protection. Dubhar was sold to Salve in 1990. In subsequent years Salve sold off all divisions to other companies. Polygram Philips Music Television and Movies Division, was sold to Seagram in 1998, merged into Universal Music Group. Philips Records continues to operate as record label of UMG, its name licensed from its former parent. Origin, now part of Ado's Origin, is a former division of Philips. ASM Lithography is a spin-off from a division of Philips. Holland C. Signal Apparaton was a manufacturer of military electronics. The business was sold to Thomson CSF in 1990 and is now Thales Nederland. NXP Semiconductors, formerly known as Philips Semiconductors, was sold a consortium of private equity investors in 2006. On August 6, 2010, NXP completed its IPO, with shares trading on Nasdaq. Philips used to sell major household appliances under the name Philips. After selling the major domestic appliances division to Whirlpool Corporation it changed from Philips Whirlpool to Whirlpool Philips and finally to just Whirlpool. Whirlpool bought a 53% stake in Philips major appliance operations to form Whirlpool International. Whirlpool bought Philips remaining interest in Whirlpool International in 1991. Philips Cryogenics was split off in 1990 to form the Sterling Cryogenics BV, Netherlands. This company is still active in the development and manufacturing of Sterling cryo coolers and cryogenic cooling systems. North American Philips distributed AKG Acoustics products under the AKG of America, Philips Audio Video, 
Norelco and AKG Acoustics Incorporated branding until AKG set up its North American division in San Leandro, California in 1985. Polymer Vision was a Philips spin-off that manufactured a flexible e-ink display screen. The company closed in 2009. Philips core products are consumer electronics and electrical products, and healthcare products. Philips healthcare products include Original Philips Shield introduced in 1938 Philips Shield in use from 1968 until March 2008 The Philips logo in use until March 2008 the current Philips logo Philips Shield in use until November 2013 Philips Shield design introduced in November 2013 In 1913, in celebration of the 100th anniversary of the independence of the Netherlands, Philips founded Philips Sport Vereniging. The club is active in numerous sports but is now best known for its football team, PSV Eindhoven, and swimming team. Philips owns the naming rights to Philips Stadion in Eindhoven, which is the home ground of PSV Eindhoven. Outside of the Netherlands, Philips sponsors and has sponsored numerous sport clubs, sport facilities and events. In November 2008 Philips renewed and extended its F1 partnership with AT&T Williams. Philips owns the naming rights to the Philips Arena in Atlanta, Georgia, and to the Philips Championship, the premier basketball league in Australia, traditionally known as the National Basketball League. From 1988 to 1993 Philips was the principal sponsor of the Australian rugby league team the Balmat Tigers. An Indonesian football club side Persiba Balak Papan from 1998 to 2000, Philips sponsored the Winston Cup No. 7 entry for Jeff Bodine Racing, later Ultra Motorsports, for drivers Jeff Bodine and Michael Waltrip. Outside of sports Philips sponsors the International Philips Monsters of Rock Festival. Philips is running the EcoVision 4 initiative in which it committed to a number of environmentally positive improvements by 2012. Also Philips marks its green products with the Philips green logo, identifying them as products that have a significantly better environmental performance than their competitors or predecessors. In 2011, Philips won a $10 million cash prize from the U.S. Department of Energy for winning its L-Prize competition, to produce a high-efficiency, long operating life replacement for a standard 60W incandescent light bulb. The winning LED light bulb, which was made available to consumers in April 2012, produces slightly more than 900 lumens at an input power of only 10 W. In Greenpeace's 2012 Guide to Greener Electronics, that ranks electronics manufacturers on sustainability, climate and energy and how green their products are. Philips ranks 10th place with a score of 3.8-10. The company was the top scorer in the energy section due to its energy advocacy work calling upon the EU to adopt a 30% reduction for greenhouse gas emissions by 2020. It is also praised for its new products which are free from PVC plastic and BFRs. However, the guide criticizes Philips' sourcing of fibers for paper, arguing it must develop a paper procurement policy which excludes suppliers involved in deforestation and illegal logging. Philips have made some considerable progress since 2007, in particular by supporting the individual producer responsibility principle which means that the company is accepting the responsibility for the toxic impacts of its products on e-waste dumps around the world. Former Operations 
products lighting products audio products healthcare products clinical informatics imaging systems diagnostic monitoring defibrillators consumer patient care and clinical informatics coat of arms slash logotype sponsorships environmental record green initiatives l prize competition greenpeace ranking publications